Hello friends, today I shall tell you P cover factor. P cover factor is a measure of traffic demand variation within the analysis hour and it describes the relationship between full hourly volume and the peak 15 minute flow rate within hour, within that hour. It is given by dividing the hourly volume by the peak 15 minute flow rate within the analysis hour. So, it is peak hour factor is given by this equation. Hourly volume, hourly traffic volume divided by 4 times highest 15 minute count. That is the definition of peak hour factor. Now this highest 15 minute count is considered because 15 minute is the minimum time period over which the traffic flow is statistically stable and that is why it is considered 15 minute. Now this peak hour factor is an important variable for facility design and capacity analysis because these facilities are designed for the highest traffic volume which will be experienced by the facility and there is always a variation in the traffic demand within the hour of study also. So this is basically to convert the flow rate into peak flow rate. Suppose, suppose you know that the hourly volume on a road is 6000 vehicles per hour, hourly traffic volume on a road is 6000 vehicles per hour and peak hour factor at this road is 0 0.85. 0 0.85 is calculated from historical data. Then the peak flow rate or V maximum or Q maximum will be 6000 divided by 0.85 that is 7060 vehicles per hour. Now, what does it mean that this facility can experience a flow rate of 7060 in a short period, in a short period of one hour, in a short period within the hour and therefore should be designed for maximum flow rate that is your 7060. Now, let us understand what is the limit of this peak hour factor, what could be the minimum and maximum value of this peak hour factor. Peak hour factor I told you it is hourly traffic volume divided by 4 times highest 15 minute count and let us say you make a count on a road from 5 to 6 pm and these are the traffic volume data which you collect. From 5 to 5.15, that is 15 minute count is 950 vehicles. In another 15 minute, it is 1150. Next 15 minutes, it is 1250. And next 15 minutes, it is 1000. So if you look at the total hourly count, the total hourly count is 4350 vehicles. Now this is the hourly flow. But within this hour, there are fluctuations from 950 to 1250. So highest 15 minute count is 1250 and therefore the peak hour factor in this case will be 4350 divided by 4 times 1250 that is 0 0.87. 0 0.87 is the peak hour factor for this road. What does it mean again that if hourly volume is 4350 then this facility should be designed for a traffic which is 4350 divided by 0.87 and that will be around 5000 vehicles. Because there are chances that within a 15 minute interval this facility will experience a flow of 1250 vehicles. That means 5000 vehicles per hour. That is the meaning of that. Now if this flow is equally divided you have a uniform flow that instead of 950 you have 1250. 
in each 15 minute interval you have 1 2 5 0 so this becomes now 5000 vehicles then what is peak hour factor peak hour factor will now be 5000 divided by 4 times 1 2 5 0 that is 1 means there is no peak the flow is uniformly distributed over the entire period of 1 hour so peak hour factor is 1 but there could be some theoretical situation when you have that all 5000 vehicles are approaching the intersection in a 15 minute time and there is no traffic remaining in remaining intervals that could be another extreme situation then in that case this will be 5000 because total hourly flow is 5000 so total hourly flow 5000 divided by 4 times maximum 15 minute flow 5000 5000 now this is 0 0.25 lower the value of peak hour factor means high fluctuations in the demand so minimum value of peak hour factor can be 0 0.25 and maximum can be 1. Normal range of peak hour factor on a road is 0 0.7 to 0 0.98. And as I told you, lower the value of peak hour factor, that basically indicates high fluctuation in the traffic demand. Higher the value, more steady is the traffic flow. And this is a unitless number, unitless quantity. And the notion of PHF is that the flow rate observed in peak 15 minute is not sustained throughout the entire hour. But in the design, you should take care of that fluctuation which is occurring in 15 minute time. So that facility is able to take the traffic. So thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any question, you can write in the comment box.